All right, I'm a little late to the party on this, but I wanted to cover specialists because they just released uh, recently Specialist Irish. So specialists, choose your role on the battlefield in a form of custom-made squads through new specialist systems based on Battlefield's four classes. Specialists have one unique specialty trait, but the rest of the loadout is fully customizable. Choosing and equipping your specialist allows you to build synergies with your squad and empower yourself to take on any battle system. Check out Irish. All right. So we got Kimball Irish Graves. He's got a fortification system. He's a veteran. Includes the DCS deployable cover to protect from bullets and explosives and the APS-36 shoot-down sentinel to take down explosive projectiles. Provides armor with additional bonuses from downed enemies. I don't know how that's going to play out. I don't know exactly what that means, what the additional bonus part of that is. We'll have to find out, wait and see. There is a video. Remember, this is bigger than us. They should have done this for all the specialists, by the way. A little, little fast rope in there. I don't know if you guys caught that. The end guy was fast roping in the assault. What looked like an assault player. Or assault specialist if there is even such a thing. Uh, the only thing I didn't like. And I've, I've been mentioning this just talking to a couple people. Was the fact that it's a very, very fast. Like almost instantaneous cast. Where you drop the shield and it just pops up. Um, maybe like half a second delay or a quarter second delay to get that thing just to... Uh, the other concern I have is, you know, with specialists, the amount of people on the field, you know, how many people can run Irish? Anybody and everybody in your squad can run an Irish. Well, you got a bunch of shields on the ground that can be abused for turtling points and in tight locations. That's that's kind of the, where I'm at with Irish. Uh, again, have to see it in action, have to see it, you know, fully flushed out, all that good stuff. So Webster McKay, uh, an ex-military lone wolf survivalist. McKay is an ass kicker with, an, with a conscious, okay. Canadian-born assault soldier fights for the non, non-pat or, uh, to make right or regret from his military days. Okay, so he comes with a grappling hook. Honestly, that's self-explanatory. Okay, so nimble. Allows the player to move more quickly while aiming down sights, further enhancing the speed-related advantages. Okay, a veteran support, Maria Black has a strong... Will that cannot be shaken by danger, fear, or rank. The skilled medic's primary motivation is to find her son David among the non-patriated. Uh, I hope I'm saying that right. Groups spread across the world. Right, the, her pistol fires a syringe at friendlies to provide healing. If fired at an enemy, the syringe will do damage. Okay, that's definitely going to get abusive in some way. <laughs> uh, combat sur uh, surgeon allows the player to return down allies to combat with full with full health when reviving. I swear for a, they they kind of they had a breakdown of their weaponry earlier. I don't know if it's still on the website somewhere. Check out uh Boris over here. Uh self-motivated and self-fulfilling Bo Boris seeks to acquire power and control in a chaotic world. The Russian-born engineer is a very experienced weapon expert on the task force, although his true attachment to the team is suspect. Um, Double agent, huh? SG-36 sentry system automatically spots and engages enemy targets detected within a certain area. A sentry operator spots the enemy target when the sentry gun locks on to the enemy in question. Hmm, interesting. Okay, okay. Yeah, weren't there, like, further breakdowns of the specialists? I feel like we're just getting, like, the bare bones here. I swear they like broke down like this thing. I remember distinctly like they said something like if you're in closer proximity of this thing, like it does it does more damage. If you're further away, it does less damage. We're gonna go with Casper because yeah. Alright, All right, so recon soldier Weakus is a loner. And the unflappable calm presence on the task force task force, an introvert. Weakest does not make acquaintances easily, but his determination to fight for a better world is rock solid. An OVP recon drone spots nearby moving targets and can distort enemies by using EMP blasts can also be used to designate targets for lock on weapons. Movement sensors, possibly the return of Pokeballs. If you guys played, uh, if you guys played Sniper back in the day, you guys know what I'm talking about on Battlefield. 
um, alerts the player to approaching enemies both while boots on the ground and while piloting the recon drone. Oh, okay, maybe that's a feature of the recon drone instead, my bad. Instead of the Pokeball. Or it's just something inherent within the, the player. It has, it's not even an actual, you know, maybe, maybe it's just like a, a, a button you press, you know, like a, a hotkey you press and, and you can use the sensor. Um, I thought that there was more, like I said, I thought that there was more of a breakdown on specialists. Um, yeah, that's going to be it. I'm not like super excited or super, you know, worried yet. I, I haven't seen something that I feel would be extremely abused. Um, I do think... Irish would be in that upper wheelhouse because of his capability that could be abused because of his deployable cover and how that could be used in tight locations and how that could be used on points. McKay, I mean, the only other person that I could see uh, potentially being a, uh, like a, a specialist being like quote unquote meta would maybe be Boris. But again, th this turret, you have to be close. If I remember correctly, you have to be close for it to do uh, the majority of its damage. So, I don't know. It could be good. I mean, it could be abused as well. You never know how these things will turn out. I really wish I knew where the hell this, this page was that gave you a further breakdown. All right, guys. That's going to be it for the specialist. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down, comments section down below. Uh, do you think that's... Uh, like, what, what specialist do you guys think that's going to be kind of... Uh, overpowered if if you think of any specialist to be overpowered at all all right take it easy guys and i'll see you in the next one